The sudden twist in Phaedratha's fate in Dune, Part 2's climatic showdown may come as a surprise, but it was long foreshadowed by a scene in Denis Villeneuve's 2021 Dune movie. In its runtime of a little over 2 hours and 45 minutes, Dune, Part 2 presents several memorable moments that stay with audiences long after the credits stop rolling. For instance, Phaedratha's chilling black and white overlaid introduction scene remains etched in one's mind as a haunting premonition of the villain's arrival. Paul's first sandworm ride also stands out as one of the most white-knuckling and ultimately uplifting moments in the film. However, as memorable as these scenes may be, the one that keeps viewers at the edge of their seats comes towards the film's final arc in which Paul and Phaedrotha's knives chip and shatter. Even the outcome of this climatic duel is shocking, but it was surprisingly given away by an early moment from Dune, 2021. Paul killing Phaedrotha mirrors his earlier fight with Gurney. Paul and Phaedrotha's knife fight in Dune 2. The first Dune movie features a scene where Gurney trains Paul by challenging him to a duel. Although Paul initially claims he is not in the mood, Gurney reminds him that he cannot rely on his mood because he will have to fight when the situation demands. Gurney's emphasis on discipline and readiness allows Paul to immerse himself in the duel, which eventually ends with Paul holding his knives against Gurney's throat. However, just when Paul thinks he has won, Gurney asks him to look down, revealing that he has his knife against Paul's torso. History repeats itself in Dune. Part 2's climatic showdown when Paul and Phaedrotha duke it out. Although the two initially go head-to-head, -head, causing equal harm to one another, the fight suddenly changes pace when Phaedrotha starts overpowering Paul. After nearly beating Paul, Fade holds his knives against Paul's throat. However, just like Gurney had turned the outcome of his duel with Paul in the first film, Paul unexpectedly turns the table by stabbing Phaedrotha in the gut. Paul's Phaedrotha victory proves why he's so dangerous. Paul's win against Phaedrotha establishes that he is not only a dangerous fighter because of his sheer will and determination but also because of the people who tutored him through the years. If it wasn't for Gurney, Paul would likely have surrendered during his battle against Fade. However, all those years of training with Gurney and other mentors helped Paul acquire a unique and diverse fighting style, allowing him to build the mental resilience to keep fighting against enemies like Phaedrotha without giving up. His training with the Freeman in Dune, Part 2 made him even more formidable.